So you're suggesting that the underlying reality is physical and it's a quantum graph. So what do you mean by it's a quantum graph? Uh, what I mean is that uh, there is an outside pattern generator and the uh, physics is exploring the idea that this pattern generator can be explained by a causally closed set of rules. Right? Somewhere out there, there is a system that generates us and that generates our experiences. And the uh, big insight of computation is that a computational system is the necessary and sufficient means to produce arbitrary patterns. And we don't have alternatives to uh, computational descriptions that are able to do that. So uh, it turns out that computation is uh, a way to frame language. And if we want to have languages that describe systems that can produce patterns and are self-consistent and can be reduced to first principles, these are computational systems. And then uh, when I say it's a quantum graph, it's a graphical representation, one that uh, disassembles a system into uh, nodes that can hold, for instance, state and uh, links between them that uh, translate the state between the nodes. This is a very general computational description. And so in some sense, we can describe everything, especially extended things that play out in a space as a graph. The space is basically, uh, a, if we talk about something like a geometric space, as a very, very regular graph that uh, happens if you zoom out far enough. So it's basically a graph with so many nodes and so many links between them and uh, so regular ways of translating information in them that you can describe the uh, function of the entire thing in the limit by um, operators that give rise to geometry.